<laughs> Alright. Okay, Hylos says tank, and Kagura and Granger, Granger Hyper. Mm -hmm. Which team do you think has a better draft than this one? Wow, they both really have good drafts, but personally, I think 9 o'clock has a little stronger upper hand in the early game, and they do have um, late game for with uh, Bruno. True, but I feel like with Esmeralda, Uranus, and Kagura, like, Kagura gives you so much of a burst that she can one-shot Bruno and Selena, plus Esmeralda and Uranus, they can tank a lot. I feel like if this game goes late, Team Gosu has the upper hand. Hmm, Team Gosu definitely could have the upper hand. I'm just worried about um, Granger's late game, but it's Gosu General on Granger, so we'll see how it goes. <laughs> There's that fangirl coming out of you for Gosu General. <laughs> uh, we don't talk about it in this tourney. Oh <clears throat> uh, well, yeah, pretty a weeb. <laughs> And okay. Oh wow, United, United States number one, um, Hylos, okay, that would be fun to watch. Let's see who goes to the gold lane. Um, Esmeralda and Alpha are going to the gold lane, well, uh, okay. Two Uranus. people, Selena and Bruno, uh, mm -hmm. from 9 o'clock going to mid lane. Mm -hmm. Stand up, three people mid, okay. And... Ooh, is that something new? Alpha's coming mid lane. He's not going to his lane. That's funny. And Maybe Al he's worried about the invade that could happen from Rock. But... True, true, true. And... Okay. Both teams going for the buffs. Selena adding traps to the nearby bushes. Mm -hmm. She's getting as much vision as she can. Kagura's taking the wave solo. Helping goes to general with the farm. Do you take that two people to clear the farm is a good strategy? Cause... People... Do you mean mid lane farm? Mm -hmm. No, no, no. For the... To help the hyper carry because I remember in the... In one of the patches, the jungle creeps would have more armor if there was people around it. I feel like, yeah, that is the con of having two people working on the jungle, but at the same time, it's pretty fast. And two people helping each other. Oh, there goes a fight. Mid lane, okay, let's see. Selena r runs out. Three people Oh, fight. that was really close. From Zoltra, he could have thrown the high loss, but... Right, that, that was very close. Mm -hmm. Hylos and the Selena, they get out. It's pretty nice. And Poquito getting dominated by the Uranus. I feel like they're going... Oh, goes to General taking down Soda's farm. And at, the... and at the top lane, we see Alpha and Esmeralda just trading. Oh, we Zoltra see seems... a turtle fight. Oh, Zoltra seems to be in a bad position and he gets first blooded. Okay. Oh. Goes to General still on the turtle. The fight's still going on. Stoner's low. The Hylos is low, and Gosu General takes the first turtle. Don't worry, he has Retreat, and I think Gosu did a really good job zoning out uh, 9 o'clock from trying to steal the turtle. Mm -hmm. I feel uh, Team Gosu having the goal advantage by 400. They're trying to get the green critter, and there's still no action in top lane. Kulse and the Alpha, they're still just farming. Balling. Yeah, both both Esmeralda and Alpha has pretty good sustain, so they're competing well with each other. Mm -hmm. And here we see Poquito just staying here, thinking, do I rotate, do I not rotate, clearing his minions, and Stoner trying to go Oh, ahead. Esmeralda, that was very close. Ooh. Soda coming up with the plays, and we see some Okay, goes to general went in. Wow, Zoltra so just all in. Oh, oh no, my. the girl no dies. Oh, wow, that's a ni pretty nice spray by Zoltra going in through the tower, throwing him out, and sacrificing his life for the hyper carry. That would definitely help. It's a very help. good trade. It's definitely worth it. Mm -hmm. 
Uh, then the teams go back to just farming. Closely general can't going bot. Selena just throwing traps, trying to get vision as much as she can. Selena is hitting on point stuns right now. Maybe the next fight will start with uh, the turtle again, which respawns in around 10 seconds. And here we see Zultra going in, Selena getting out. Yeah, Selena. it's really cool how um, Gosu is really trying to take control of the field where the turtle is respawning. And the Granger trying to take turtle again, Hyla trying to go in, he ults in. There goes Hylos. Their team goes in all the way. Alpha low HP. Is Alpha going to die as well? Kill, kill Alpha. Is there going to be another trade? The Hylos dies too. And oh no! Team Gosu yes. wins the trade with taking the total and two kills. Hey, that was definitely a win for Team Gosu right there. Almost creating a 2,000 lead between them. Team Gosu is leading. The early game, definitely Team Gosu has dominated the rounds. Um, do you think 9 o'clock would be able to do a comeback mid-game? Well, they do have a Bruno and a Poquito. They do a lot of damage. And late game, if Bruno gets some space, he can easily shred all of the tanks in Team Gosu. He can shred Uranus, Esmeralda, Jawhead without, with ease. Here we see. Oh, Team Eugene! Gosu. Oh no! Ah, Eugene got picked off by uh, 9 o'clock while Team Gosu was at spot lane. That's a, that's a good trade by Team 9 o'clock taking mid tower. But wait, what do we see? The Alpha coming in to help, but Esmeralda purifying out. Zoltra with a throw again! Oh no, this is. Oh, oh 9 o'clock. Oh my god, this tank, he's making... I wish we had tanks like that when we were playing Mobile Legends. Well, we never have a tank when we play a trio, so too bad. Yep, Team Gosu taking top tower. They're really dominating Team 9 o'clock, taking their farm, card room jungling, putting pressure on them throughout the map. Mr. General, uh, he's always rotating with his uh, supports and jawhead. Yeah, it's very hard for Team 9 o'clock to really pressure them. And there goes the third turtle! Wow, Zultra with another throw, Hylas pops the heal. Do you think Zultra will survive this? Those who general takes the turtle. Kaguma oh, Zultra got picked oh. off. But they, 9 o'clock is retreating right now. So Kito is about to be picked off again. Uh, okay, hey. what seemed to be a bad situation for Team Gosu was turned around by Zultra and their team. They took two kills and a total on the expense of one. And they're about uh, to get a total too. That is three turtles, another fight going on. Seems like 9 o'clock is playing pretty passive now. They don't want to die because they can't afford to give Gosu another- There we go. Camps, and the game's about to be resumed. It seems like Paquito is also having quite a difficult time against the Uranus. True, Paquito and the Alpha both, I would say. The Alpha is 0 to 0. He try he's trying to save Another throw from Dahad! Oh wow, Zoltra is a bad man today. He's making so many godly plays. Yes, and, and goes to General and Eugene is a stoner. Yeah, Eugene and Ghost General are both keeping up with his throws. Mm -hmm. I feel like Team Gosu is about to take bot tower. They're about they're really pressuring the Paquito, driving him away into his second tower. And do you think they're going to dive him again? Don't oh. think so because nine o'clock is probably gonna back off just in time for that dive. Here we see Selena with her snipes, but she's not hitting them anymore. And Team Gosu takes the second tier two tower. This is really going to put pressure on Team 9 o'clock. Esmeralda is really able to farm on top lane and just keep pushing the lane. 
It's 9 o'clock campaign to handle four people from Gosu. Oh, Esmeralda oh. with that dive! Esmeralda doing her job right now and good work by Zoltra getting out of the uh, flickering out. So how can 9 o'clock really um, get out of this situation where they're getting pressured bot lane and top lane and the gold lead with Gosu is around 7k right now? Mm -hmm. Do you think they have a late game? I don't really think so. I do remember uh, Alpha has a pretty bad late game and so does Selena. Their only uh, chance of winning this game is by Poquito or Bruno. They do something. I don't feel like Hylos will be able to do that much. He's not a playmaking tank. And. There goes another team fight. Hylos with the glorious half rate. Like, oh, wow. Eugene and going in with the Kagura yeah. and the Esmeralda, Kose. Oh, he is pressuring front lane for 9 o'clock. No one can tank all that damage. And look at that Pogito doing all of his damage, and, and look at Stoner going in, emoting, and getting out. That's the closest just Stoner a, I know. Right, just the perfect team fight from uh, Gosu. Mm -hmm. And Nox, I'm sorry, this team kind of, this game kind of seems one-sided. Team Gosu is really dominating them. Right, they are. Maybe, perhaps, it's the difference began with the turtles that and 9 o'clock gave to Team Gosu. Gosu general is nice, and look at Stoner, he just winter truncheon all of his damage away and just left out. Oh, there goes Jawhead again, he is diving in, but oh no, he is stuck in the enemy base, but... Look Esmeralda with the back off? Esmeralda going well. in? Look at Zelda oh, wow. doing a nice tank, saving those who general before himself. The turrets cannot defend, help defend uh, 9 o'clock against and, Gosu. And Team Gosu has a 11,000 goal lead. I don't really know how Team 9 o'clock is going to make it back from that. Eugene with another kill. Uh, look at in. that shield! Selena getting deleted! Oh my god, this has been a stomp. And Team Gosu taking two inhibitor towers. Kylo's oh, running no. in, but his team has to defend. Path of Glory didn't really do much of right there. True, and do you think Team Gosu will wait 12 minutes for the Lord, or are they just going to take it? Well, there, there we go. I think they're going to do the Lord. I think it's definitely the safe way and the right way, too, to just get Lord. Storm their uh, flames with minions and win the game. True, 9 o'clock but... can't really contest it. But as Gosu General was taking the lore, there was a team fight. Esmeralda goes in. Like, look at Kusei, look at his big shield. Esmeralda with the infinite shield. There's no one that can kill her. I feel like this is just GG for Team 9 o'clock. The Lord's coming in, so super minions, Zoltra just oh, popped it in. Oh, oh no! Oh my god, god, that wombo combo! Those who oh, the legendary, but unfortunately Esmeralda dies. I think they're just going to take more kills. The Kagura dies too, and the Lord is and going that to that is in. game. That was game one! Victory for Gosu. Yup. That was a really good match by Team Gosu.